Oh, we're headed to the beach. Join us. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. Today we are driving to the Outer Banks, specifically what's that city we're in? It's not, usually Salvo. we go to Avon, we're going to Salvo, Outer Banks. So this will be a two-part series, technically a three-part series. Two parts for the first half and second half of the week, I hope, plan for, um, in Outer Banks. And then we're also going to be doing a trip to all, I think it was six of the lighthouses, of the major lighthouses in Outer Banks, and show you where they are, show you what they look like, um, a little video tour of them, and then the two vlog videos will be things to do in Outer Banks, things to see, roadside attractions, um, places to eat, so follow us along. Right now we are in Virginia, I think we are outside of Richmond, we have five hours to go, 265 miles to go, and that's what it looks like right there. We were sitting in traffic, not anymore. So, we'll check in in a couple hours. Donut break. <laughs> so, checking in, we have four hours to go now. We are now a little bit south of Richmond, Virginia, I think and we're passing through it and the sun is finally out. We are using the Comet AI to assist with the driving. So it is keeping lane centered right now. You see my hands are not on it um, nearby because this is just an assist. It's not a completely takeover, but we're just cruising along. Listen to John Mayer. <laughs> The beach! <laughs> now we are in Duck, North Carolina, headed towards Corolla. Some people say Corolla. Corolla? Corolla. Whatever you want to call it. Let me know in the comments which is right. Um, we're heading up to, I'm going to say Corolla, to start our um, lighthouse tour series, which will be next week's video. If you want to check that out, it will not be in this video. Uh, we are slowly making our way through Duck, North Carolina. Traffic is uh, wonderful. <laughs> Look at that. Just slowly meandering around. All the tourists. Don't run them down. But we're going to go all the way up to that lighthouse in, in Corolla and then work our way back down. Probably hit about two today and then get to the, uh, the rental house and then check that out. Alright, so then we finished up the, the filming and filming and walk around very briefly at the uh, lighthouse in Kerala. Um, now we are driving all the way back down south where we're staying, which is an hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes south. Um, we start at uh, Kerala and then we go through Duck, then we go through Kitty Hawk and Nags Head and then a bunch of little random cities. 
as you'll see in this time lapse that's playing over over me talking, um, and you can definitely see the, the different types of areas. Like when we were in Duck and uh, Kerala, um, it was very a lot of really tall trees, very closed in. You were kind of like just going through like little neighborhoods of just woods. And now we're entering Kitty Hawk, and it's very it's, it's a lot more open. Um, and then as we exit and go through Nags Head, Nags Head's very um, a lot of stores, a lot of, a lot of buildings, stuff like that. And then after Nags Head, then it just opens right up. And then it just goes into the abandoned, uh, the abandoned islands, it seems like, where it's just road and a little bit of sand on either side. And then we go through that all, a whole bit, and then we get to where we're staying. Which we'll see in a second. Well, it's gonna be a green. Oh, it's not Punch it off! Shit. <laughs> okay, there she goes. All right. Good thing this window is so clean. <laughs> and this short video is going to serve as a transition from driving to getting to the house. And go. So this is the view off the back porch of where we're staying. It's interesting. It's a lakefront. It's a lake in the middle of the land. <laughs> so the beach is over there. The sound side's over there, but there's just this random lake right here. And we have a pool down there. Oh, I see a grill down there, too. Look at all the turtles. And lots of turtles. This camera is not going to see that. Coconut's head up. I'm swimming around. Fishies. Did you see a fish? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And there's two more over there, and then there's one more over there. Over here we have a pool. I heard it's not that deep. We'll find out. Over on this side is the the main master bedroom. Well, here we are in Outer Banks. <laughs> this is my radio voice. <laughs> 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 this is my first time zoom, playing with zoom, zoom. <laughs> Walk the plank to the beach. Well, this, this is better than walking over the uh, dunes. Sure. You have a little boardwalk on our cart. We can pull it all the way and then support it down this... Oh, don't even have to support it down these steps. <laughs> it's a ramp. Oh, there's a ramp. Huh. That's good. We're gonna go Take ramp. the ramp. Yeah, we're, we're testing our, our cart. Wow, this will be great. Of course. So even if you take the ramp, it still pushes on these stairs. Yeah. So. The ramp only gets us so far. Or we could have just taken a couple steps. Yeah, I think that's the best. Up to here and then. Yeah. <laughs> We're going down. <laughs> wow, this is a short beach. Wow. Five steps in here. High tide. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> and we made it to the ocean. That's all, folks. <laughs> I mean, I guess you get used to it. It's 
not bad once a couple oh, waves yeah. come in. Yeah. Oddly short beach. Mm -hmm. Like, I guess we would... I guess everybody sets their tents up, like, up there. Yeah. Maybe... <laughs> maybe right here if it's not high tide. And welcome to day two. We are finally on the beach. We got here at uh, we got out here at about what 8:30. Set up these tents. These nice Amazon. Oh, this one I got off of Amazon. That's that's Sarah's tent. You'll see her in a little bit. We got the chairs set up. Put these right there. Get the water. <laughs> Hydration. Hydration on the beach. <laughs> and sitting and watching the water. Now on today's the day we're going to spend probably the entire day on the beach because this is the only day where it has the lowest percent chance, I think no chance of rain, 80 degrees. After today it kind of drops down to the 70s. And it might be a little rainy throughout the day, so we're not going to get that full, full, complete day in the sun and on the beach and just, just today. So, we're going to enjoy it today, and then I'll check back in in a little bit. Sarah's grilling. Oh, shit. Sarah's dropping everything. My camera just fogged up. Yep. <laughs> so we have a lakefront view right here. This is where all the turtles come out. A lot of fish it looks like. Some kind of fish. Oh, that's a snake. I think that's a snake. We'll leave that be. So we've got a porch going up. And then under here, two showers, all the way out to the pool. Day three views. This is the far left side of the porch while it wraps all the way around. Oh, it keeps going. Whoa, cicada or something. All right, just checking in for day three here at Outer Banks. We got a lot of sun yesterday. Now it's 10, 10 o'clock and we're back on the beach again for a few hours. Sarah's here, haven't seen her for a while. <laughs> so we're just hanging out on the beach and then a little bit later we're gonna be going north to check out some stuff in Nags Head. We're going back Shout to Nags Head. Shout out to Mr. Farmer! <laughs> <laughs> All right, see you in a little bit. All right, it's afternoon of day three here in Outer Banks. Um, Subaru got to check engine light, of course. There has to be something. Um, so we drove up to AutoZone up here just to get an idea of what the what the check engine light was. But as I was driving, I was looking at gauges and looking at everything, and I narrowed it down to thermostat, coolant related. Um, probably thermostat, and because the uh, temperature gauge on my on my uh, car is basically sitting at cold. It's not even, it's not rising up at all anymore. Um, and so I found out there's an open recall for 2019 to 2021 Subaru everything really um, with this engine type for the thermostat control valve, the TCV. Um, so people say it's okay. People say they've driven it for a year. It's just no eyesight, no self-driving, no safety features. Everything is completely disabled. So that's fun, but it still works. It just it just is reporting really cold right now. Um, we'll probably get less miles per gallon. Maybe it'll just pop back into place and work again after a bit. We'll see. Now we're going to our lighthouse number two. Roanoke Marshes Lighthouse. That one, is that not that not lighthouse lighthouse? This is the only lighthouse on a river on the Outer Banks. And a lot of people don't go to this one because it's the people don't consider it a lighthouse of Outer Banks because it's not super tall and it's not 
um, on the ocean. It's just, and this is also the third iteration of the lighthouse. Um, this particular one, the first one, I guess, did wasn't built to withstand the elements of South Carolina or North Carolina, and then the second one, same deal. Or the second one, I think they tried to move it, and then it fell apart. So and they had the third one, and, and this is the one we're going to now is kind of like a recreation of what once was, because they've all fallen apart. I remember all that. I did. <laughs> <laughs> Yep, so we're going to go to that one next, but you'll see that in next week's video. Check out Lost Colony Tavern. If it's open. It's so close. It doesn't look very open. Sunburn. Yeah, you are. It's only been two days, three days. <laughs> What'd you get? As I slowly move the camera down. You got what? Crab cake sandwich. Oh, and potato, potato salad. salad. And I got pulled pork barbecue and fries, of course. What'd you think of the sandwiches? Delicious. Your crab cake sandwich yeah. was good. My my really pulled good. pork was really good. Definitely would recommend. I didn't wasn't feeling a sandwich shop, but I'm glad we went. Mm -hmm. Now off to the next lighthouse. <laughs> right? Right. Right. Washington Balm Bridge, Roanoke Sound. I feel like a fly just bit me right now. <laughs> Boy. Haunting fly bites. Haunting fly bites. Phantom. Phantom. Oh yeah, bikes. Phantom. Storm's brewing. Next hand. Wow, if you get a note a turtle or a dolphin, you gotta call it in. I think this was your old highway. You were asking about it? Oh, yeah. I'd say this is probably the old highway. Before they made it, what was it? Was it two lane or one? Still one lane, just bigger, taller. What's two. Two and two? Yeah. Well, four. I never knew, what are, you, what are you supposed to count? Travel lanes in one direction or all travel lanes? I thought it was all travel lanes because this is technically a two lane road. You see one lane, it's like, uh, yeah, I can. Well, one lane would be one, one, right? I thought that'd be two. Two lanes. I don't know. Why is there a podium? Does want to make a speech? No, it's, it's a trash can. Yeah. It's a trash can. It's a trash can. Good morning, welcome to day four of the Outer Banks. This Subaru still doesn't work, so I actually have to drive. <laughs> We're going to the Orange Blossom Cafe and Bakery. This is this is one of Brittany's favorite places. They make these uh, apple fritters that, what are they called, apple uglies, apple uglies. and they are humongous. The sandwiches are good too, and cinnamon buns are good too. Uh, we wanted to go yesterday, but yesterday was Labor Day, so they were closed, so we are coming down here, going there, then going to the uh, Cape Hatteras um, Lighthouse. Yeah, it was Cape Hatteras, yeah. <laughs> Cape Hatteras Lighthouse, and then I'm getting me a uh, Mexican hoodie from the, uh, what's it called, Wings? Serves? Wings. Wings. I knew it was a, it was a noun. <laughs> Just to know what noun it was. 
it's, it's looking like, I don't, I don't think that's a lighthouse. I don't know. It looks like from the distance, the lighthouse we want to go to it has like scaffolding all over it, but we will find out. Um, but first, we're getting breakfast. Ice, cinnamon roll. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oops, I got some icing on the bag. Looks like a cheeseburger. <laughs> there it goes. Way better than a cheeseburger. Show us the goods. What is this? It's called a Mondo sandwich. Bacon, sausage, cheese, egg on house-made Italian bread. come to Outer Banks is to go there. <laughs> yeah. And I think we've said this is one of th at least three trips. Hopefully. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put it on the record next time we split a sandwich. I did my own sandwich and that was a bad idea. Mm -hmm. And cinnamon roll. <laughs> Couldn't even get to the apple fritter. The big ugly as they call it. And now we're going to wings. And then we're gonna walk this off at the next lighthouse. So off the wings to get some t-shirts and stuff. So we got some shopping to do. Farmer's Daughter, then Life is Good, then Hatteras Landing. I think it's the whole place's, place's name and I think there's a wings way over there. Farmer's Daughter is going to be the um, dangerous place because I see Yeti authorized dealer right there and they're going to get me with something I don't need. Let's do it. She didn't know there was a step there. Mm. So two stores that sell the exact same stuff. <gasps> what? You want it? <laughs> you can get it if you want. We can just go look. It's a cool little marina. So we drove all the way down to where the ferry goes to uh, Ocracoke Island and just to get our Baja hoodies. Got our Baja hoodies, now we won't be cold. She's not too happy about this. But we did that. And then we stopped at a thrift store and she got a $1.50 spaghetti strainer it's with stars. It's a vintage stars. strainer. Vintage, vintage. vintage metal. Um, Yep, there it is. It's a strainer, but it was a dollar fifty. And the person that sold it to her was not happy that it was marked as a dollar fifty. She was upset. Yep, we didn't do anything else. We walked around, got some Yeti. You got a Yeti cup. Did some shopping. We're done shopping. Done. It's Tuesday. Wednesday. Tuesday. Today's Wednesday or Tuesday. Tuesday. Dang, it's only Tuesday. That's good. <laughs> but it's also Tuesday, and we've spent too much shopping, so we're done with that. No more shopping, right? Right. Deal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we're going to the Oka Crook. No, no, no. There, the Cape Hatteras Lighthouse. Yes. But there's construction on the road, so we're going through that now. But that's a video for next week. You'll see, you'll see that next week. Wah, wah, wah. Check this out. Under construction. Can't even can't even see it. We were here. It's in here.
up.